Erie County wants you to clean up after your dog. An eye-opening campaign is taking a hard look at your front yard. Drivers are noticing billboards popping up around town about this. News 4's Brian Shaw tells us why. You may have seen a few billboards around Buffalo from Erie.gov that look like this. It's pretty eye-catching, but the information that they represent may be more surprising. The campaign is part of the State Storm Sewer Water Permit Program, and one of the elements to that is public education. The billboard campaign is basically to uh, make people aware of certain uh, regular routine household practices that they encounter every day that have the potential to, if, to impact stormwater if they don't do things the right way. The storm drains that you see on the sides of the roads don't end up in the sewage treatment area like the plumbing in your house. It ends up in the rivers and lakes, and then the lakes get polluted from bacteria. There are four billboards, one telling you to pick up after your dog, one talking about washing your car, one about lawn care and pesticide use, and then general storm drain information. By walking your dog down the street and not picking up after your dog, you're leaving a source of bacteria and pollution that can then enter our storm sewer system. The misconception is that dog waste is good fertilizer, like cow manure. But since dogs are not vegetarians, their waste is highly acidic. If you wash your car at home, then the soap, dirt, and oil from the runoff can end up in the storm drains. So it's recommended to wash your car on your lawn or to go to a place that will do it for you that takes care of the runoff. Right now, the main source of pollution that's affecting water quality in our lakes that's causing our beach closings, that's causing uh, you know, fish advisories and those kind of things is what's called non-point source pollution. The way non-point source pollution gets from the land to the water is through stormwater. Brian Shaw, News 4.